Joanna has a question. Will the anaerobic sediment in the bottom of a water tank introduce potential bacteria risk? Clostridium species live in anaerobic wetness. Would that mean it might not be safe to drink the water or irrigate crops with it? Well, Joanna, everybody in Australia in the rural area lives on water tanks and more or less always has. Uh, this water tank I'm stood on is a concrete tank I built 18 years ago. It's 20,000 gallons. Um, and we haven't cleaned the bottom of the tank yet. The, out, the outlet pipe is above the bottom to allow sediment to build up. And you can see we have a lot of trees around us and there's 300 square meters of roof that come in, the catchment comes in through these down pipes into the tank. There are little first flushes on this, but there's a lot of material that does go down into the tank and you get this anaerobic layer at the bottom. Now, generally, if it's not overpowered with some kind of imbalance of input, like you've got one particular tree that's very, you know, has a lot of essential oils in it, or it's uh, allelopathic. Um, so you get a, a concentration of um, an allelopathic oil in the tank, and therefore you get an imbalance in the anaerobic ecosystem of the decomposition at the bottom of the tank. As long as it's reasonably well balanced, the material going in all breaks down just safe. Um, it's a safe ecosystem. It's a balanced ecosystem. So the water coming out of this is first rate. We've had it tested. It's nicely, slightly alkaline because it's concrete. That's why I like concrete tanks. They don't burn in a bush fire, although they could crack in an intense heat of a bush fire. Um, they're long lasting, but because they're made out of concrete, they're slightly alkali and that's a little bit better for our health. So we don't have any problems with that. Irrigating crops, not a problem at all, but mainly this is drinking water. This is the water that I drink and I bathe in and all our tanks at Zaytuna Farm are concrete tanks. Around Australia, people have um, plastic polypropylene tanks and also the traditional tin tanks, the, the metal tanks, which are now today aquaplate and guaranteed for 20, 20 plus years. But uh, this one's 18 years old, still going fine. I don't see why it won't be here in another sort of 50 years. We probably will have cleaned out the bottom by then. Um, that's easy enough to do. Or there are devices that actually take the water, that take the sediment off the bottom while it's in position and keep the tank continuously clean. I like the fact that we have uh, an anaerobic ecosystem involved in our drinking water. I think it boosts our immunity system. Um, one of the worst things you can do for your health is be too sterile.